Yo, what's going on everybody? It's iPod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. It's time to get into episode 6. It's finally time for me to step foot on the NBA court. Let's go, y'all. Gonna be a great year, starting right now, baby. Right now. Only in the NBA. What a way to start out your new career. Happy Halloween here on opening day. I'm Kevin Harlan along with Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. Are you as ready as we are? It's the NBA on 2K Sports. Glad you could join us. See, now we're starting off on the wrong foot already. The cameraman, first of all, doesn't have no right to be zooming in on me in my warm-up. And secondly, I have no right to be throwing this powder right now. I am not LeBron James. I am nowhere near this guy. It's all good. All right, it's time for the coach to let me in. Show him what I'm worth, man. It's time to show these guys that I belong in the NBA. Let's step on this court. Harden comes in off the bench for his first playing time in an official NBA game. Well, what a great player he's proven to be, guys. There are so many things he does well, and I love the way he works. I mean, he's just out there before every game trying to improve his skills. And that always helps an owner, a coach, rest easy when a guy has his talent and dedication. Okay, now that we got that out the way, I think they were playing keep away from David Carter, but it's all good. I finally got the ball in my hands. It's time to show off a couple moves. Even though I'm not the best dribbler, I still pull up in his face and I'm able to hit the shot, man. That's what we doing out here, double moves all day. Now, Lopez, I cannot stand Lopez, man. If there's one thing about Noya, I can't stand him. Now, even though I didn't get that rebound there, I'm going to still show my team that I got stellar defense. So, I'm going to get him with the backcourt violation. Yes, I'm out here cheating in these streets. I don't care about nothing. Now, it's 17-17. I decided, you know what, I'm going to be a team player. I'm going to run in my blue circle. And they actually run a play for me out of the offensive set. So, I'm like, you know what, let me run this little isolation play. Try to put Steven Jackson on skates and do what I do. Oh my goodness. Did you see the between the legs? Look at look at the cameraman. He decided to give me a replay. <laughs> now we're up to we still got a nice little hold on these guys. And they're actually giving me the ball. I'm so happy about this. So I gotta show what I'm worth, man. I gotta hit these shots all game. See the show and make yourself heard. Come out and support your hometown Hornets. The Machine, a terrific starring attraction. Not to be missed, so get your tickets now. So come out and welcome our sensational new rookie. See, now one thing I will say, man, <laughs> the Noya be having me looking real good on these billboards, man. They're commercials, man. They, they make me look real good out here. I ain't even put a point on the board yet, and they already got commercials rolling for me. But I like that, man. You know, it's good to be the number one pick. But I'm sitting here trying to run a little bit of isolation. Ginobili is sliding his feet like a pro, but I still pull up for the jumper, man, and that was off the glass. So I don't know if y'all saw that. Y'all might have to run that play back. But now, you see Vasquez passing it to Lopez. You already know what he's going to do. He botches the layup. He doesn't hit the shot. And guess what? I get the rebound, but they sub me out. I can't understand that. Lopez is out here missing shots. But I'm grabbing rebounds and y'all sub me out. Man, let's get into halftime. And now, brought to you by Sprint. The spookiest day of the year. Halloween. It's really not that scary. Not during the 2K Sports Halftime Report, anyway. Out in New Orleans, the Hornets are ahead against the Spurs. Defensively, some great shot blocking. They're giving them something to think about when they head inside. We've seen Kawhi Leonard having a superb game. Shouldn't be a shock to anyone. We've seen him put up big numbers before. And for San Antonio, they're looking good in their own right. They've taken full advantage of their trips to the line, and that's made a key difference. Vasquez is giving them a great boost. He's got nine points and is also helping set the table. Who's ready to eat? And now we'll send you back to New Orleans Arena for the start of the second half. I know y'all was loving them slam cams and those cookies being taken in the halftime show. But you see Green pulling up for this jump shot here. He doesn't hit it. And I just patted my stats a little bit more with another rebound. But I'm here to come down and score points, man. I need to at least get 10 points. So I go right up into Steven Jackson's chest, get the layup. It's a no call, of course. So now I'm pissed off, man. This is where you get mad at 2K. So I'm here guarding a point guard knowing darn well I'm not even supposed to be up here. And guess what Eric Gordon is doing? Nothing. Just standing still. So Steven Jackson hits the shot. Pick the man up, for goodness sake. 
but it's all good. It's 59 and 51. I'm the run, I'm gonna run in my blue circle, you know, do what I do. But check out Gordon. He just pulls up for any old type of shot. So I say, you know what? I'm gonna do the same. Give me the ball. I'm gonna call my quick isolation, and I'm gonna put Steven Jackson on skis. Oh, 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 oh no, that's crazy. What? Seriously? Damn. Oh, and the coach ain't messing with me right now. He sent me right out. But I come back into the game. It's 68 to 62. Sometimes, man, if you do something wrong, boy, the coach will take you out real quick. But I go up and attempt Duncan's chest. I'm able to get the foul. I wish I would have up and under there, but, you know, I wasn't thinking. I thought I was going to dunk on him. I do got the posterizer right. I guess sometimes your signature skills just don't work. But I'm able to hit the first free throw. I need to prove to these guys that I'm actually good from the free throw line. That one kind of rattled in. So I'm going to shoot this one with a nice shoulder shrug. I'm saying I'm going to put that joint up. It's cash. You know, all net. You know what I do. <laughs> now here, this play, I don't even know why Ginobili pulled that three. He wasn't even wide open for it. I guess they would just want to do anything to try to come back. But you see me coming down the court with a head full of steam. I try to get a poster dunk, but of course they only give me a contested layup with no call. It's all good, man. And they take me out for the whole fourth quarter. So, as soon as I come back in, I'm putting the moves on guys, splitting the defenders, and going in looking like a madman. You see the Sprite Slam cam? Oh, oh, no you don't. My bad. But Tony Parker right here is pulling up for a jump shot. Totally contested. But you see me running down the court on a fast break. Austin Rivers passes me the ball, and I hit the three. It's cash. And it's wet like water. Man, homeless is going to be right about that wet like water. But you see me and Austin Rivers chatting about who did better in the first game in the NBA. Of course, you know, I told him he ain't shit. You do <laughs> That's what we do, man. We trash talk, but we bros like that. But you see us in a, in a uh, locker room right here, you know, checking out my VC. I said, yo, man, my paycheck was a little bit more heavier than yours. But what is 194 VC? Can I even get a headband with that? <laughs> After tonight's game, you're now officially an NBA player. Were there any nerves for you stepping onto the court for the first time? <laughs> you think I was nervous going into this game, for real? <laughs> I was born to play ball, man. When you out there on the court doing what you love to do, it just comes natural. Nerves aren't even a part of the equation. It's gonna be a long career for me, so save some of your questions for all the other times I'll be up here. 